If you are a banker or finance professional, do not miss this video. Paripasu first and second charge. What it is? Let's understand with an example. Let's say ABC Limited has taken a loan of rupees 25 crore from two banks A and B. For this loan, they have given a security worth rupees 40 crore and there is a Paripasu arrangement between these two banks. Now this ABC Limited want to raise another 30 crore. For that, they have approached Bank C and it has placed a request with Bank A and B to have Paripasu arrangement with Bank C as well. Now this Bank A and B did an analysis. They have given a loan of 25 crore for that they have security of 40 crore. It means they have collateral coverage of 160%. Now if they accommodate Bank C, total loan amount will increase to 55 crore and collateral is same 40 crore it means collateral coverage will fall to 73 percent so these two banks decided not to cede paripasu first charge instead they agreed for paripasu second charge for bank c the impact is if abc limited fails then the available security of 40 crore will be first distributed to paripasu first charge holders and only the balance will go to paripasu second charge holders so understand this paripasu first charge second charge is basically priority or ranking of creditors claim to specific assets or collateral in the case of default or liquidation